have been so excited about this new display to store all my favorite sunglasses on. This is a great way to organize all your shades in one area. It's also pleasing to look at and very convenient to access. There is no better way than to have your favorite style sunnies laid out in front of you. Also, don't forget to check the necklace holder toward the end of this video. So materials you would need for this project, different sized frames. Now if you're wondering where to get these frames, you could check your local thrift store or also go to yard sales. You will also need spray at hair, some metallic gold paint or any paint of your choice actually, ribbons, decorative nails, super glue, pencil for markings, a ruler and a pair of scissors. I will be recycling my old picture frames I have sitting around my garage for years now. You can also find some great frames in your thrift store or yard sales. This part is optional since my frames are a bit blah to look at, so I'm going to paint these gold. This will make it stand out against my boring eggshell walls. To paint them, start cleaning the frames by wiping them down. Next, spray on paint adhesive. Let it set for about one hour and then spray on your choice of color. Let it dry for a few hours and spray on a second coat. Lastly, you could spray over a protective glaze finish. This will give it a nice a shiny finish and protect the color from fading. So let it sit for a day at least. Once your frame is dried completely, you can now start to add the ribbons. Take your measuring ruler and pencil out. Have the back of your frame facing you. From the top, mark three inches down on both sides. Then go down another seven and a half inches and mark both sides just like you did before. Now make sure both sides are even. If your frame is big enough, make another set of markings below. Now cut your ribbon according to the width of your frame. Make sure to leave an extra one inch length. This way you can nail the extra length on the sides. Next, add a dab of super glue near your pencil markings. Then place half an inch of the ribbon on the glue area. Let it dry. The glue will help the ribbon from fraying at the same time it gives it an extra hold. Next, take out your decorative nails and pin over the glue end of the ribbon. Hammer it down if you have to. Repeat on the opposite side. You can keep adding rolls depending on your accessory collection or the size of your frame. Another practical way to make use of your frame is by screwing on hooks. This way you could hang other things such as necklaces or earrings. This can also be challenging depending on the wood of your frame. If the wood is too soft, you can end up splitting the wood, and if the wood is too hard, then it will almost be impossible to screw the hooks on. Mark where you like the hooks to be placed. Then drill in your holes matching the length of your hook. Luckily, my handyman hubby here lended me his power drill and also taught me how to use it. Once your holes are in, you could screw in the hooks. Don't be intimidated by using a power drill if you've never used one before. It's pretty easy. Thank you guys so much for watching this video and remember to share and like.